This is the book of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 25. Agree with thine adversary quickly, whilst thou art in the way with him. All right, shalom, shalom, yes, Allah. First and foremost, we want to open up by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of the great millstone who do teach and rule well. All right, we are the prophets in Babylon here in Tampa, Florida. You know, coming at you with a quick lesson concerning agreeing with thine adversary, man. All right, you know, the hot topic is right now what's going on with this uh, Camp WFI, Watchmen for Israel. And you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and play the video and we'll go ahead and talk about it. Bring it out. All right, let's go on. So like you have technical difficulties. Right, and as you see, man, the, the cop was asking him simple questions, man. Simple questions, and that's why we're bringing this out, man, because this is an example of what you do not want to do when you get involved with the police, man. If a policeman comes out to your uh your camp, try to uh, fix that. Mm -hmm. When a policeman come out to the camp, hey, man, just just do what you got to do to uh agree with thine adversary, really, man. You know. But we're going to go ahead and uh, show this video one more time and we're going to do some commentary on it. Lord willing, it plays through. Uh, yeah. He said, please cooperate or you're going to go to jail. So right. he gave him opportunity to cooperate, man. Yeah, he was he was asking kindly. I guess it's not yes, going to play. Yeah, it's probably no purpose. But what we'll do is I'll put the video in the uh, beginning of this so, you know, uh, y'all can see the video. But he asked them, you know, nicely to to cooperate, man. Hey, and let me see if I can pull it up on my phone. A, a, a lot of you, a lot of y'all already, already seen the video, man. Right, right. Circling around Israel, showing you these guys, you know, what I'm saying, doing things not according to scriptures. And I, I actually, I had just did a video on it too, and made some commentary on it, just going into everything that those brothers did wrong. Now, ain't nothing against those brothers in particular, right? But it's just the fact that. You know, these brothers are doing this whole Israelite thing. You got to do it according to the scriptures, man. All right, the most I can tell us how to deal with every situation according to how, you know what I'm saying, we, we may come across it. So if you come in out here teaching, the scriptures say that before you can teach you, we must first be taught, man. Yeah. All right, and simple scriptures are like, agree with the adversary quickly. Um, Matthew 4, chapter 5, verse 25, we're going to bring it back out. Shows you how to deal with these certain situations, man. All right, first of all, we are in the land of our captivity. All right, we ain't got no rights. We ain't got no authority here. All right, the only authority we have is these scriptures. And we can say by these scriptures through our, through, through, through our Lord and the Holy Spirit. But when it comes to Esau and the white man, they, they don't hear that, man. They're going to scoff. You, you, you hear it sound like one of the officers was scoffing and mocking that guy. He pointed to, to the uh, sign. And it's like, oh, so, so did your Lord do that too? And that's what made him get all, all you know what I'm saying, emotional and stuff. But at the end of the day, when the cops come, man, hey, just give them what they're asking for. They ask you to move. They ask you to be quiet down. Quiet down. Give them what they're asking for so you, you, you can go about your way or they can go about their way. Or if they tell you to move, just move. Don't get proud. Don't 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 get all bent up in the spirit trying to be this big old Rambo. All right. Then you find yourself getting arrested, man. Yep. All right. Or it could have ended worse. Like I was going to, going to the video that, that I did earlier. This man, um, his, his, his name is Adam Abbott. Nyquam. Nyquam. All right. The, hey, the, this brother, he's he's the head of that camp. So by him acting like that, that, that not only could have got him put to death, because, hey, when you when you go against the Lord, the, the ordinances of the Lord, hey, you, 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 you're you likely to get put to death, man. That's why you see Jake get gunned down in the streets, man, because the Most High ordained that power over them, and they are uh, going against it. And by going against it, hey, the Lord gives that, that man the power to kill you, man. Con. And that man could have not only got himself hurt, but the other brothers in this camp hurt. Yep. Okay, instead of just applying the scriptures, man. Hey, so, the, the, and really the reason why we're going into this is because it all could have been avoided, man. That's right, that's right. You know, now, the, the, when the cop came up, he said that he had a, a, an appearance, which re really means that they were coming to arrest somebody, man. 
they were coming to arrest somebody, whether it is, but the thing is, is well, the cop was giving them a chance to not have to go to jail and to appear in court. Yeah, yeah, exactly. exactly. You know, just to just appear in court for whatever it was, the servants of the peace, whatever they were saying. Mm -hmm. All right? Hey, and I want to add this too, because we, you know what I'm saying, we, all we saw was that clip, so maybe yeah, right, right. it just came out of an overworld aggression. However, maybe, hey, the scriptures, you know what I'm saying, are still um, plain and set. But nine times out of ten, they probably asked them to quiet down but before, and they kept on going. They got These guys got to have the mega. Uh, right. Phones and phone, stuff, yeah, man. Right, right. All right, and, and it's all really a show to be seen. You saw these guys getting arrested. He's quoting scriptures. Hey, pull this, pull that. It's all, it's all to put on the show for Israel, because Israel, like, hey, these guys like clickbait, um, clickbait too, man. Yeah. They do certain things in their videos to try to get to cause an uproar or whatever. And then they put in the caption, some little slick ass cap caption. Nine times out of ten, the caption don't even match with the video. You know what I'm saying? So it, it, it wasn't for 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 the right reasons too. It was it was just really to to, to, to be seen to men. They come out there with a the little the beating nigga sticks and they clapping the sticks against the ground. Yeah, that's right. And they just, you know what I'm saying? They ain't, they ain't even prophesying. They, they just cussing out Edomites. Right. Trying to 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 to, to the bait. So when the cops came, they feel like this is the time for them to, to shine. The time and, for them to put on the show. Yeah, man. But go ahead and read that one more time. This is the book of Matthew chapter 5, verse 25. Agree with thine adversary quickly. And that's what he should have done. He should have agreed quickly. He didn't agree quickly. He started questioning the cop. You know, you don't do that, man. If the cop tells you, hey, uh, you go over here, I got to talk to you, just go, just move, man. Mm -hmm. Just move because Romans 13, which we're going to grab as well, you got to uh, uh, obey the powers that be, man. That's right. Because ultimately the Lord gave these damn devils the power over us right now, man. That's right. We that's have right. no power, man. That's why the scriptures say, uh, uh, thy worm Jacob, mm -hmm. thy wow, worm man, Jacob, man. All right, that's that. Hey, we have no power, man. So if, uh, if, the, if the feds come up deep like that, man, they tell you to move. Just move, man. Agree yeah. with thine adversary quickly. If you would have applied this scripture, you probably wouldn't have went to jail that night, man. You probably still would have had to appear in court. But even then, the Lord could have had it to where the whole thing was just scratched away. Thrown out. Because you could have went over there and just talked to the cop. Hey, man, what's going on? Hey, my bad, officer. We'll, we'll, wait, we'll pack up. We'll go, man. Mm -hmm. And then you push the word somewhere else, man. All right, we ain't telling you to stop pushing the word. Keep pushing the word. You know, the word must go out. And, you know, we give credit where it's due. The brothers out there, they pushing, you know, they pushing. So all praise to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shai. But there's there's certain things in they doc. They don't believe in the mark of the beast. Yep, yep. You know, so that's a whole other topic, man. The problem with, with, with these brothers is they they, they lack things concerning the, 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 uh, the uh, spirit, man. Yeah. All right, when it comes things concerning the spirit, these, these guys just don't have it, man. And I'm going to tell you something, too, man. Seeing that this video came out, ever since I seen it came out, I've I, I seen brothers posting it. And I've seen brothers on comment boards. And it's, it's, it's showing a division, man. All right? It's yep. showing you two different houses. The house of Saul and the house of, 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 of David, man. I got to say. Because a lot of these other guys, the house of Saul, they carnal, man. Very carnal. They're carnal. Oh, y'all going. I had a guy. I did a video on it, too. The guy said, so if, if, if y'all are teaching and the cops come up to y'all and tell y'all, y'all got to quiet down the movie, y'all going to do it? And then he put the clown emoji. But then I go on his page <laughs> and he ain't got no damn links to, to his videos, man. Hey, look. This is, this, is one of the, this is one of the guys that follow... Uh, a, a brother Nyquam, he commented on my post because I posted it on, on uh, uh, social media. Like, hey, just agree with. I say, man, just agree with thine adversary quickly. This could have been avoided. You had all these minions from uh, uh, WFI come on a post. One of them said, I disagree completely. I said, then you disagree with the scriptures. Mm -hmm. He did not agree with its adversary quickly. A soft answer turneth away wrath, but grievous words stir up anger. He said, La a, ah, I don't, which means no, I don't. Proverbs 28 and 1. This is this is this is the carnal mentality that these brothers have. Proverbs 28 and 1. The wicked flee when no man pursueth. This is the scripture that he put up to try to defend what the, the, the brother Nyquam did. Yeah, and I can say too that it was a what they, 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 they use is a bunch of milk scriptures. Right. And they completely had the wrong understanding of them. Right. Use them completely out of context. So what these guys are using is, 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 is they're novices. They're, they're guys that just came into this thing probably like, like I say a, a year to six months ago. And, and they found a couple basic scriptures and they get proud. They get puffed up. Right. Puffed up with knowledge, man. That guy posted that scripture like we never heard that before. Like He got puffed up and put, put some milk scripture down and say, oh, yeah. Boom. Thought he was, thought it was going to be a big old <laughs> bomb going off. Drops the it. mic. Yeah, drops the mic. No, you, you, quote, you quoted that wrong, man. So these guys lack understanding. That's why I say they lack the fruits of the spirit, too, because hey, they can't spiritually discern certain things, man. Even the scriptures. And well, then, what else he said? He then was, you had another guy that said Proverbs 20 and 24, man's goings are of the Lord. So they bring they, they bring these scriptures out 
you know, trying to justify what this brother did, man. Look, a part of this truth is rebuke, man. That's right. Open rebuke is better than secret love, man. And a lot of these guys in these other camps, not just WFI, but a lot of these other camps, they're man pleasers, man. Like what what uh, IUIC they, whatever Nate says if Nate says hop on one leg do the hokey pokey and turn around the whole congregation the whole doing congregation this shit, do that shit. because they, they, they looking up to this man mm -hmm. all we're simply doing is telling you this could have been avoided and yeah. ultimately guess what man's goings are of the Lord so the Lord did ordain that to happen for you to go to jail the brother to go to jail. And ultimately to be an example to Israel on how not to be. That's right, that's right. When that's a police right. officer comes out, what not to do. Exactly, exactly. And it's through the spirit that we do these lessons about it so that we can edify on a, on a court, well, how things are supposed to go according to the scriptures. Because yep. if, if the brother who went in no wrong, they, it, it, we won't be doing these videos. Right. But if we're doing these videos because something, something they did wrong that wasn't according to the scriptures that could have been adjusted. And also an, an, a, a, an example and a lesson for the other brothers that, that, that's starting to come out and go out and teach and stuff and bring out this word. Hey, just, hey man. And and they, they might think, oh, yeah, those guys just coming again. They hate you. No, 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 no. This is for your, for your own good, man. Open rebuke is better than secret love because as we're rebuking you for doing this, all right, it can save not only you from another incident where this might happen or some another Jake where they might end up getting gunned down or something because they're trying to get, you know, Billy Badass against the police officers in the land of their captivity, man. Hey, the scripture's saying, we're going to grab it as well. The scripture's saying, a carnal mind is enmity to the most high, man. Uh -huh. These guys have a very carnal mind. Let me, let me just read what these guys say, man. L this is their argument, which there really is no argument, man. Mm -hmm. Because at the end of the day, the scriptures hold the most weight, man. All right, and these guys misquote scriptures, but he said, Proverbs 20 and 24, man's goings are of the Lord. How can a man then understand his own way? Which is beautiful. That's a beautiful scripture. But that's not a scripture you should apply to justifying wickedness. Like if someone takes the mark of the beast, you can't say, oh, well, look, hey, the scriptures say man's goings are of the Lord. No, no, no. That's and, not. That's, and, and, and then they think you're still going to go, 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 be accepted. Yeah, justified. That's, that's not how it works, man. It says, all, he said, his uh, Instagram is Yayan for Israel. It says, all decisions is made by the Most High. It wasn't the Most High's will for him to keep it moving. It was for him to stand bold, and he passed the test of the Most High. Oh, my God. So he said, it's public. They not even blocking the sidewalk. If that's the case, then they go to jail all the time in Baltimore. They not breaking no law, King. You should know every decision is made by the Lord, and that was the Lord's decision. I said, clearly, man's goings of the Lord, and that's why he was also arrested in a situation that could have been avoided. It's not hard to understand, and these guys, you know what it is, when, when rebuke comes, these guys are out on the highways three, four, five hours a day, rebuking they, they people, rebuking Israel, but as soon as rebuke comes to them, they can't take it. Now they get carnal, now they get bent out of shape. Oh, y'all hate y'all brothers, y'all. No, we don't. Open rebuke is better than secret love. Rebuke is love, man. All right? It says, I said, ultimately he failed because it, it could have been avoided. This was set up by Yahawashai as an example of what not to do. Hey, man, to, on to that point, hey, the Lord can put a, put, 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 if you got that, that spirit of pride on you, you know what I'm saying? Just a, 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 a rebellious, wicked ass nigga. Hey, the Lord can put a spirit on you to lead you to your destruction, man. Mm -hmm. He can cause you to, hey, run out in front of a damn a, a, a semi truck and what you're gonna say well man's going to the lord you're right man's going to the lord but hey yep. uh, the, the, the lord a hey, lord does not just do good he do evil too yep all right he's good and evil the lord hey, the lord can lead you down the right path or the wrong path all according to how you gonna use these scriptures man yeah, how you gonna handle the scriptures you gonna deal with and ultimately scriptures. what happened is the lord ended up sending evil angels among that that man at that 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 very moment to where he was you know rebelling against the powers that be which is against the scriptures. So the, the Lord ultimately is in control of everything, man. We're not, right. we're not, we're not disagreeing with that. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, but we're, what we're saying is that it could have been to the point where the brother didn't have to go downtown, man. <laughs> he didn't have to go downtown, man. God. That's all we saying, man. God, God. Yeah, if he would have handled it with wisdom, executed wisdom. Oh, hey, Salakia, scriptures say a soft answer turneth away wrath. You, hey, Salakia, our Salakia officer, where you? My bad, officer. Where you want me to go? Over here, you talk to the officer one on one like a man. And you, you, hey, okay, my bad office, we'll pack up, we'll leave. He didn't have to go downtown that night, man. Yeah. Hey, scriptures also says when a man's ways please the Lord, he makes yep. his enemies to be at peace, peace with, with him. Yep. So what happened was when you, you want to get, you want to really get spiritual with it. What happened was the Lord saw those men, those men was doing, 
It was for a show. All right, it, 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 it wasn't out of sincerity. That's so why when the cops came up, he started putting on this whole, sh this whole, this whole facade. What? 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 what, what you say? What you say? And he, all that shit that they was doing, they saw that shit on TV. Other niggas doing that shit, man. Oh, 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 oh! Where's your commanding officer, Sergeant? 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 You know what I'm saying? Just being, Get your dog. Just, 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 just being disruptive and obe disobedient niggas, man. And you know, this shows you that your ways wasn't pleasing to the Lord. Is that that they they came in that fashion, man? Because we've dealt. Listen, man. Us, we don't. We, you know what I'm saying? We ain't been in this truth for 20 years and like that. But we have experience in this thing to know because what we've been out the camp and we've dealt with cops multiple times, man. Yeah. Cops that came up to us times I can't even count on my hand, man. Yeah. And every time it's never ended in one, one of us getting arrested. Yeah. It's never ended in them, and I'm hemming one of us up because we deal with things spiritually, man. Okay, you got to deal with things in a spiritual manner to avoid carnal situations, man. Yeah. That's the reality of the life we live in, there, man. Hey, the Lord said it would wait. Be harmless as doves, or uh, I cast you um, out, out in the midst of wolves. Be as wise as serpents and harmless as doves, man. I got that right here. Go and bring it out real Matthew quick. Matthew 10 and 16. Behold, I send you forth as sheep mm -hmm. in the at, midst hey, of wolves. As sheep. Now, what is a sheep doing? Is a sheep uh, uh, fucking gnashing his teeth at people? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Sharpening his paws and, and his claws. or You know what I'm saying? Walking around with AK-47 strutting around his back? Nah, man. A sheep is a docile animal. Okay, a sheep is, is a calm animal. If, if, if you stand in front of a sheep, the sheep going to go e e e either run away from you or go around you. It's not going to run trying to headbutt you. Right. Go ahead. It says, Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Mm -hmm. Be ye therefore wise as serpents. Now, serpents are very, you know what I'm saying, they, they're very wise and crafty. You know what I'm saying? What they do is before they strike, they, they, they wait and they wait for the proper and, 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 and good a, a chance to strike. Yep, very and when cunning. they strike, they, 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 they come with everything, man. Yep. So you, you, if you were smart, you would have thought, that, okay, this ain't the time for me to strike right now. This ain't the time for, hey, I have, I have, I have no, no, no dog in this fight. I'm just going to do what this man say. Pack up my, my camp so nobody get hurt. You, you, you think, what about the brothers around me? What about, you know what I'm saying, if a cop kind of, you know what I'm saying? You see all them videos. What if I get videos? arrested? <laughs> what, like, what, what, you, can get, you, you, hey, you can get put to death. Right, right. The Lord could have had you get put to death right there and you bleeding out. And I'm pretty sure, you know how they, you know how they do. They got to have the women come out with the children and stuff. Yeah, yeah, You know what yeah. I'm saying? It's, 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 it's a whole damn show. Sitcom going on over right, there with right. Jake, man. And that show is not, it's not out of sincerity. And because of that, the Lord will have these situations come about. Yeah, hey, hey, these camps, man, they love entertainment, man. That's right. This truth is not about being entertained. Hey, and Jake loved to be entertained. Jake, that's all Jake want to do is be entertained. That's why they got their wives out there with the umbrellas sitting that, in the hey, chair. And that's, that's entertainment, man. Yeah, exactly. Like they had the beach and shit. They had the beach or some shit, <laughs> and man. And that's exactly why these guys' videos get thousands upon thousands right. of views. Right. You know what I'm saying? 20,000 views in one night. 30,000 views in one night. 50, 60, uh, probably 100,000 views in one night. Because what? It's entertainment. They ain't on that learning nothing. They they hearing what you're saying, but it ain't, it ain't, it ain't resonating. All they looking for is some, some hey, confrontation. And a lot of a lot of their followers is women, man. Oh, yeah. Because you, really, these women, they just look, they just eyeing. They seeing, oh, he cute. That guy that guy up there, he, he look good. So a lot of, of y'all followers is women, man. They just hoard them. Which is, yeah, exactly. Promoting whoredom and shit. You know, so uh, that, and that's that's that that that's why we we are doing this lesson, man. They, they turn around real quick. <laughs> it says, behold, it says, behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves, man. Be harmless as doves, man. So hey, we gotta be in that spirit of being harmless, man. Yep. No matter what comes and comes, 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 comes upon you, it, the Lord says it's time for everything. A time for love and a time for peace and a time for hate and a time for war. Okay, so right now in that particular moment, that was a, that was a time of peace, baby. That was a time. Hey, all right, officer, you got officer, you got it. This man is a warding a gun, man. Okay, he got a gun, and he, and he Lord said he do not bear that 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 that, that damn sword in vain. Mm -hmm. So he ain't got it on his hip just just just, just for fucking you know fashion, man. He got it on there because when it come down to it, he ready to pop one of you, Jakes, man. Yep. You saw the Jake at the end of the video. He was um. He was like uh, uh, barking at the officer, and the officer just in his eyes, he shows you that he wanted to slay this nigga, man. And if you could just keep playing these fucking games, the Lord gonna allow these devils to slay your ass, man. Yeah, hey, you play, you, you played a big bag wolf in the time of Jacob's trouble, your ass gonna die, man. Mm -hmm. You trying to bark back at, at, at the cops and bark back at the military soldiers, your ass is gonna die. And the Lord is gonna bring, when you get, when you get before the throne, the Lord is gonna show you these same scriptures, man. 
Hey, agree with that adversary quickly. A soft answer turns yeah, away red. It's, 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 it's all in the Bible that you was, you, you, was, you was claiming to be teaching, right? Right. So how come you you wasn't teaching that part of the Bible? Con. That was a prime example to teach that part of the Bible, man. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what we do when the cops pull up on us. If we gonna teach that part of the Bible. Real and, quick. And, 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 as we move. So the cop said, walk this way or you're going to go to jail. Mm -hmm. And this brother thought in his mind, it was, okay, it was okay to question the cop. Oh, whoa, 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 what is this? What is that? What is this? No, man. You just agree with thine adversary quickly. If you would have done that, you wouldn't have went downtown, my man. One of the Jakes said they got to explain it. You Israelites need to understand Esau don't got to explain a damn thing to you because the scriptures say that they will hold themselves not guilty. They will slay you in the street and hold themselves not guilty, man. And ultimately, it's, it's the Lord, man. All right? Hold on, hold on. Hey, yo, yo, let him go. Let him go. Yo, let him go. Let him go. Check your man. Check your man. Check your man. Check they got the plan, man. These niggas acting like they, they, they in a Black Panther movie, man. For real, he telling someone get axed, getting arrested, brother. Come on, man. You 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 making a fool out of yourself, man. <laughs> You're making a fool out of yourself, getting arrested, and really, he, it's a show. Hey, that shit like, like, a, like, a, like a Black Panther documentary, man. Yeah, brother, really trying to just put on a show, man. That big bad wolf. For the women. For the women, right, all the women over there. Oh, oh, what a he's bad to, boy. He's trying to score some cool points. Try to, yeah, exactly, man. Come on, hey, man. Hey, 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 the Lord ain't dealing with that, man. And we're going to show you what's going to happen to, to him, man. And that's because he's out of, he's out of contact. Like a madman at the end, man. Like he was tripping, yo. Hey, so if he was, Paul's repeating the scripture was, if it be a God, then it shall not come to naught. But hey, obviously it came to naught. Okay, they, they, he got put in that, that damn paddy wagon and he got took down the road. All right, I'm sure the camp closed up and everything was all over, man. So it, it obviously, obviously got brought in. But I, the, the, the point of me saying that is that scripture was out of context. All right, the scripture was out of context, man. So they, they, if that was the best thing that he, that he could pull, he he missed over all these scriptures right here and grabbed that. Some ain't some is not right with, with these guys, man. Yeah. Let's, let's bring this back up though. Hold, hold on to that. Con. Um, Matthew chapter five verse twenty five says, "Agree with thy adversary quickly, whilst thou art in the way with him, lest at any time the mm -hmm. adversary deliver thee to the judge." So now he's about to get delivered to the judge because when you when you go to jail, you might be in there for a night, and in the morning they have they have a court inside the jail where you you gonna go see the judge, right? And the judge is gonna go is gonna appoint you your judgment. It says. And the judge delivered you to the officer. So the officer, the, the judge said, okay, well, you know what? We're we, we going to leave you in here for, we ain't going to give you no bail. You've been here, how many times are you going to give you no bail? We're going to leave you here for, 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 for a week, or two weeks, a month or two. Guess what? Then that judge is going to appoint you to the officer and, and you're going to bat back to jail. <laughs> All right? So that, so instead of you just losing the pride, packing up and going somewhere and teaching somewhere else, now you might be in jail for a week or two. <laughs> or or if, 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 even, even if a day, that's the time the word is not going out because of, of your own stupidity. Yep. All right, and and you know, just completely, just you know, being carnal, man. Yeah, being Ooh, carnal and being just carnal. completely forgetting the scriptures, man. It says, "And thou be cast in the prison." Now, this, this, hey, these devils can say that you, you know, resisted arrest. I'm pretty sure that I, I believe, I believe that's a felony. Yeah, <laughs> you, you add up enough felonies, you go into prison. All right, but it says, "Verily I say unto thee, thou shalt shall by no means come out thence." Till thou hast paid the uttermost farthing. So now, now the brother got fines to pay, man. Court fees. I'm sure he got court fees. I'm he sure he has get, fines. He probably probably won't get probation, some shit. Probation, hey, yeah, so right. You, all you doing, all you doing is, 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 it's like walking uphill backwards, man. Yeah, you're making it hard on yourself. The scriptures say, uh, um, uh, force not the course of the river, man. Yeah, in this, in a situation like that, don't force the course of the river, man. Go with the flow. That's right. You gotta follow the spirit. But that's what these guys have a hard time doing is following the spirit because they do this for entertainment. They do it for followers. They might have not been anybody in the world, so they need that 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 nice little uh, umph, you know, 
and and that's just that's just not how this this true what this truth is, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and, and when you come into the truth, you ain't supposed to really have a lot of followers, man, or, or friends or, or buddies. You know, you're supposed to lose all that. Yeah, yeah, and and then everybody ain't supposed to like and love you, man. Yeah, that's what they did to the false prophets. Yeah, you're really supposed to be hated. And that's why these guys, they, they can't figure out what the market of beast says. They can't figure out the hour temptation. They can't figure out what Jacob's trouble is. They don't go into these things, man. And if they do, the the, 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 the whole doctrine is, is completely lopsided, man. And this man right here, like I said, the, the, this guy, he 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 hey, he been ahead of them, brothers. Listen, man, he obviously don't know these scriptures. So that's not, not only him fucking up the doctrine, but he putting a whole lump in that damn camp, man. <laughs> It, uh, how does scripture go? Um, if, if the blind, be, if, you know, um, if any leaven, if oh yeah, a little, little leaven, leaven with the whole lump. Yep, yep. So that little leaven right there, of him not knowing these simple scriptures, can get his whole camp hemmed up, man. And really, that's what that's what happens, man. Is you know, I, I've seen a lot of these guys that that uh, are in this camp that follow after this the, the brother Nyquam, and they teach just like him, they act just like him, they they they're they're, they're literally trying to mirror this brother, man. Mm -hmm. And he doesn't got it, man. You gotta get back. Get out of the roadway. Get out of the roadway. I ain't on the road. I ain't on the road. This is a parking space. This is a parking space. Know what y'all talking about. Know what y'all talking about. Know what y'all talking about. No. You talking to the powers that be telling them know what y'all talking about. Jeez, man. He, the, the, the guy simply asked the brother to get out the street, man. Mm -hmm. Just get out of the street. Just, and that's another, a whole other situation. You could have got arrested right there. Yeah. They, if they wanted to, they could have just arrested your ass just, just because. Yeah, and the scriptures talk about ha, ha, that about the cost, the gospel being not blamed, man. Right. All right. So if you're doing these things and it's not according to the scriptures, and, and the whole world is, is, is looking at this portion of Israel, looking like, oh, these niggas is just rowdy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it, le it leaves a stain on niggas, the nation, man. man. They look at us like that. Like, you look like no other nigga, man. That cold hearts pull up on and tell them that they, they got a loud disturbance. Right. You're like no other niggas, man, getting wrestled with the police and shit. So, hey, you are causing a. Uh, uh, um, um, a blame to be on Israel, man. Because hey, when when we look at that, we look, hey, the Lord gonna look at that and say, well, I told you how to do it. I told you how to go about this, and you didn't go about that. But but, but, but you push into other Israelites, younger brothers. You got younger brothers popping up out the mouth talking about some no, this ain't nothing wrong with that. No, he was bold as a lion, and they thinking to say that's that shit cool. So now you pushing a whole different vibration to Israel, of a carnal vibration. Carnal, yep. And, carnal you know, mentality. The Most High, he he, he gonna he, he he gonna deal with these things, man. Yeah. He gonna deal with these things. Um. I ain't blocking traffic. I ain't blocking traffic. I'm not blocking traffic. I can't do it. I'm not blocking traffic. Yeah, man. I'm not blocking traffic. Uh, so I can get to see where we at. Yeah, man. The, the thing is, is these guys, man. When you when you take that carnal route, it's gonna lead you either two ways, man. Either death or in jail, man. That's it. All right. Now I had these guys that that came on the comment board and they were like, well, what about, what about Daniel when he was casted into the lion's den? Or what about all the old prophets? Well, the thing is, that was, first of all, that was prophecy to happen. And this brother is not Daniel or John. Hey, and they didn't buck up. And they didn't buck up. Daniel was in the lion's den. Right, right. He didn't fight it. He went to the lion's den. He had prayed to the Lord and the Lord had him in the lion's den. He'd get you better by the lions, man. Same with John with the, uh, uh, with Patmos, man. Yeah. You didn't see him getting all rebellious and no, man. You go with the flow. Yeah. If you got to go to if, if, now, if the cop would have came and said, "Look, I'm taking you to jail," all right, that's it. Hey, what's the greatest example? Yeah, how shot, man? <laughs> right. What did Yahweh shot do? Even when they came and Peter smoked one of the man, one of the man's ears off, Lord, they took that man's ear, put it back on, and healed that man's ear. Told Peter that he that lived by the sword but shall die by the sword, man. Mm -hmm. So the Lord he, he even went out in, in, in a certain way and fashion how 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 and it was an example for us, man. Yep. That wasn't an example for Israel, man. That, that, that right there is going to get a Jake put to death out here, man. Yep. Get a Jake put out, put to death, or, or, or get a Jake cast it back into you know, in, in a prison, which in that modern day prison system is slavery. So you got to be careful who you're taking your advice from, man. Okay? A lot of these guys ain't fit to be teachers, man. They ain't fit to be out here, you know what I'm saying, bring, bring, bringing this word because they ain't bringing it out properly. They ain't doing it properly, man. That whole, that, that whole fucking f f f f show that he put on right there, man, that whole. F f f you know, facade. facade, man, that shit was, uh, it, it was entertaining. I can tell you that much. It was entertaining. That's what it was. And and, and that was their exact goal, to bring some entertainment out of it. Okay, instead of bringing the spirit out and showing, you know what I'm saying, uh, 
great example of the spirit. They brought you entertainment out of that, man. And we actually had a video where it was like, what, maybe a month or two ago? Mm -hmm. The cops came up to us. Somebody called the cops on us. Happened to be two Jake cops, and they got edified, man. Okay? So let all things be done through what, what the spirit of edification. All right? Let things be done so that it could be edifying to the body, man. That wasn't edifying to the body. That was just a, a bunch of fucking ruckus, a bunch of nigger tree, man. And, and it was embarrassing. It was, it was definitely embarrassing. They had on the shirt fringes and shit, man. Shirt fringes, they just, right. they, they just, It ain't no different than, than, than any, any other nigga with some damn fr They just got fringes on, man. Yeah. Um, This is the book of Romans, chapter 12, verse... I, I, I'm going to get that. Okay, I'm, go uh, 12, verse 18. If it be possible, mm. as much life in you, live peacefully um, with all men. Yep. So even even the, even the cops, man. Mm -hmm. Even hey, even Esau, man. As much as life in you, live peaceably among all men. And these guys, you had that one guy barking at the cops. Get your dog. Get your dog. Sergeant. 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 You know, like what are you what are you doing, man? That's not the spirit of y'all watching me all shy. Right, but you got simple Jake say, oh, them brothers is bold, standing bold as a lion. Okay, well, look, you stand that bold in the time of Jacob's trouble and your ass gonna die, man. Hey, and what that is, is, is that right there, it's called that rebel spirit. Yep. Jake's in that rebel spirit. And the spirit, the scriptures talk about that the Lord shall destroy all the rebels out of Israel, man. All you Jake's that, 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 that's in that fucking Black Panther, you know what I'm saying, uh, 1980 spirit, nigga. Hey, the Lord <laughs> gonna destroy you, man. Yep. You're not, you're just like how the Black Panthers got taken down, the U.S. gonna take it down, man. You can't come in that spirit. We can't come carnally with a carnal man. That's fighting fire with fire. What you gonna do? That's gonna burn everybody down. Yep. You got you, the Lord said, wise as a serpent and harmless as a dove. You gotta use your mind in this thing, man. And this truth is about using your mind, okay? Jake, man, okay. Jacob, the, the what, what, uh, uh, supplanter? Yeah, finesse. He was a finesse. Yeah, that situation, man. Hey, you know what's wrong with Jake is they they don't they act before they think instead of thinking before you act. You gotta think before you make an action, man. Because every action has a, a reaction, man. Yeah. And yeah. in this in this case, the reaction was the brother going downtown. And, and, and you know what? That's fucking common sense. Right. That's fucking common sense. If you, if you look at any situation, if anybody is resisting or disagreeing with the police, they're going to arrest you. But because Jake coming to this truth, you get it simple, man. When you come into this truth, that don't mean you just throw out common sense. That don't mean you just uh, you take, out, take common sense out, out, out of your head and say, I don't need this anymore. I found, I found the truth. I got the Bible. Nah, man. You got to hold into that common sense still, okay, and use some of that shit in these situations, man. Yep. Okay? If you, oh, it's speaking simple, on that. Man. Uh, it's simple. What you got? I had another one, but this just came up uh, right here. Um, the book of Sirach, chapter 37 and 19. Mm -hmm. All right? Because the brother, we're not going to take this away, that the brother had knowledge, man. But the problem with brothers is they don't apply the knowledge to themselves, man. So this is the Sirach 37 and 19. There is one that is wise and teacheth many, mm -hmm. and yet is unprofitable to himself. Mm -hmm. All right? So when you get this knowledge, wisdom, understanding, it's okay if you know it. Hey, you can know all the scriptures in the world. If you don't apply it, you're unprofitable to yourself, man. Mm -hmm. the, the whole point of coming into this truth is not just having an arsenal of scriptures on your mind or you can call out this scripture, call out that scripture. You know, that's pleasing to the eyes. Mm -hmm. But what are you doing behind closed hey, doors? Are you hey, applying the word? To man's eyes. Yeah, right? That's to man's I, eyes, that's right. That's what it's for, to be seen to that, And that's what it is. It's pleasing to the eyes. That's why these Jakes, you know, they, they see these guys calling out scripts, and they're like, wow, this brother got all these scriptures. He memorizes them. But are you applying them? Are you applying them to your life? If do you, you were, really even understand them? Right. Do you, believe, do you even believe? Do you believe these scriptures, man? Because if you believed Matthew 5 and Romans 13, you would have applied them, man. Yeah, and being taught these scriptures is not just reading off a of paper. You got These scriptures got to get broken down to you properly, man. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you this right now, man. Those guys are under HOI and Zabakinum. That, 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 that's who they call their elders. So your elders ain't teaching you properly, man. Right. They're not teaching you properly. Simple scriptures, simple breakdowns, these guys don't even, can't even break them down properly. They, they, they use them out of context. So it shows you that, hey, something's not right over there, man. Like, maybe a lot of things ain't right over there. Yep. They all don't know what the market of the beast is. They all, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they try to equate the, 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 the market of the exemption <laughs> with the market of the beast. And, and, and it's just like, you know, just showing you that these guys are on a very low level, man. Hey, these, these guys, this guy, uh, uh, Nyquam, did a video concerning uh, the third woe. He, he doesn't even say that the, the, the woe, the first woe, the second woe, and the third woe is world wars, man. He breaks it down completely incorrect man mm -hmm. so you don't even know about you really these guys uh really forsook the true elders of israel man yeah and yep. went their own way 
They yeah. tried to come up some other way, man. Yeah. Hey, listen, man. And they falling. The true elders are the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone, man. And that's it. Hey. That's not out of pride. We're not even in Great Millstone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we got a camp prophets in Babylon, but we humbled down enough to say, you know what? These are the true elders. Yeah, and that's what I'm always going into my lesson, too, is that these are the true elders of all Israel. Yep. Okay. Whether you want to believe in that, whether you want to be in denial or not, these are the true elders of all Israel. And once we realize this, all we all all all, all we could do is is, is get on, a line. Hey, get in line and respect it, man. Yep. All right. Hey, and then study from the true elders, man. That's it. The Lord is dealing with these men because they they they, they have showed us all these ways of course scripture breaking down scriptures all these different ways, the right way, so that when, when we see these things happen in real life, hey, we already know what what was that you that messaged me that said what, what scripture come, come, come to mind when you see yeah, this? Yeah, yeah. And it, immediately we all had scriptures come same Christmas same, come, same come scriptures. to mind. Right. But for these guys, they had that scripture come to mind about, you know. For man's goings are of the Lord. Like, or uh, what, what, what he was quoting out about, um, if it comes to not, we completely yeah, misunderstanding that right. scripture, man. Right. Because, hey, the, the apostles were cast into prison time and time again. And, you know, th th that scripture come from somebody saying, oh, yeah, well, it, it, you know, if, if, if it's this not be of the Lord, it will come to not. Meaning that it, it will not continue. But they were still getting cast into prison. So that's, uh, that was a low level of the, of the understanding of that scripture, man. Okay, it was a very low level. And these guys are low level. And it shows. Yep. And that's how we know the, the, who the true elders are, man. You should know a man by their fruit. Mm -hmm. Look at the fruit of the elders, man. Look at the fruit of the elders. Not only have they been pushing 30 plus years nonstop. But look at look at their fruit, man. You know. Hey, and not to mention these guys' is fruit, man. Yep. Cause we seen that too. All right, yeah. these guys' is fruit. You saw him on the comment board talking about some what what, what he was saying. Man's going to the Lord. Man's going to the Lord. A basic milk scripture that you learn when you and so butchered when, when you sucking on the titty. You learn that, that scripture, right. man. When you when you first come into this thing and it's, 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 it, it, your eyes still bright because all oh, you find out you Israel and stuff. You learn that scripture, man. And he used that scripture and didn't even break it, didn't even use it properly. That, 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 that's context, man. That, that right there is just, you know. That's detrimental. <laughs> it's, it, 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 well, I think more so it, 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 it's, it's fucking scary, man. Yeah. <laughs> it shows you Jacob don't know what the hell going on, man. Yeah, yeah. This is why the Lord said he's coming to destroy two-thirds of Israel. Because these Jakes really, they, they just, as much as they try to get it, they really can't get it. Hey, and the scriptures say that he's going to start at his house first, man. Mm -hmm. So judgment's going to begin at the Israelites that know that the Israelites, man. Right, but you got that? Yeah, um, so this is uh, Romans chapter 13, verse 1. Let every soul be subject unto the higher power. Now, I brought this scripture out, and you had a guy say, Well, I said, Did, did this? Did, I said, I asked him a simple question Did the brother apply Matthew 5 25 and Romans uh, 13 and 1? He said, Well, yes, he applied Romans. He said that Romans 13 and 1 is talking about Yahweh Shai. I now, that. now, that. when you read the scripture, read it again for me. It says, let every soul be subject unto the higher powers, go ahead. for there is no power but of the most high. Now, when you really go into the scripture in the context, it's talking about the, the powers that be. Hey, I'm going to read some more. Go ahead. The powers that be are ordained of the most high. The powers that be, which is what? Whoever's in rulership at the time. Right now, the powers that be are these Edomites, man. And if he said that it is ordained at the most high, then obviously it's not the most high. It's not, yeah. that, that's it's not, not him. That's not the power it's talking about. Right. It's talking about the powers on this earth. As you on this earth and these fleshly bodies, we got a, 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 a government, a power ruling over us. Yep. And so the, 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 uh, it said, let every soul be subject unto the higher powers. The higher powers is really Esau, Edom, man. Yeah. Right now, they're in the higher power seat, man. They have higher power over this us. This is their kingdom. This is their kingdom, right. So read that again. Just like in our kingdom, we're going to be subject unto us, the higher powers. Yep. Same thing for us, man. It, yep. it's, 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 it's plain. Let every, yeah. What the scripture says? Scripture, scripture is plain, plain to the, to the holy, holy, but a stumbling, stumbling block, block to, the to the wicked. Let every soul be subject to the higher powers, for there is no power but of, of the most high. Mm -hmm. The powers that be are ordained of the most high. Go ahead. Whosoever therefore resisteth the power. Which was happening, he was resisting the power. The higher powers came to him, which were the police, and they said, look, come over here, step over here. What? Huh? Who? Nah. Who? When? Uh, where? where? I was thinking all these fucking questions, man. That, you resisting the powers that be. So really, the Lord, the Lord is in control of the powers that be. Hey, and this right here is the perfect time to be doing this lesson because we're coming into a time where these devils about to make their move, man. Yep. And they're going to come down with military troops, man. There ain't going to be no fucking little police, officers, the, 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 right. the police department. It's going to be military troops, man. 
And what the military troops gonna be doing is, they, is, 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 is they're trained to kill. So yeah. any bit of resistance, they're just gonna mow your ass down, man. And that's and that's it. That that right there is, is, is the end of your damn ministry, man. All right. <laughs> and the scripture says to endure it to the end. All right. It says, um, whosoever therefore resisteth the power resisteth the ordinance of the Most High. So you are resisting the, the, the ordinance and the fashions of the, of the Most High. Yeah. It says, and they that resist shall receive unto themselves damnation. Now listen. <laughs> So if you if you resist the power, you're gonna receive to yourself damnation, man, which ultimately is gonna be death. If you if you're resisting those powers in the times that be now, when it comes to the microchip and it comes to this V, hey, we no, we yeah, ain't taking yeah. that shit. Well, well, if, if it goes against the scriptures, if it goes against but the, the scriptures, scriptures right. said nothing about about this right here, man. The scriptures told us about the friend. It said it said to, to, to disagree. Yep. Pretty much, the Lord tells us certain things, like for instance, when the market piece coming about, don't don't take that shit. Obviously. Obviously, right, don't right. take that. Because because what the Lord told us not to, and it's against the law. It's against the law. But agreeing with the adversary quickly is not against the law, man. That's something simple. That, that, that right there is a matter of pride and ego. Right. Like for okay. instance, if, if the cop told you, hey, take this chip, and you take it, you would be breaking the law. If the cop tells you to move and you move, you ain't breaking no laws of the most high. Just move. And, and, and if, in fact, you follow if you following this commandment. You exactly. You following this, right? Um, you guys are all about the law though, right? Um Verse three: For rulers are not a terror to good works, mm. but to the evil. Mm. So the, the rulers ain't a terror to, 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 to people doing the good works; <laughs> they a terror to the evil, man. That's hey, like I said, we, we we the cops came out to us most of that camp, and they, you know what I'm saying? They, they, it's always the same situation. You know? They say, hey, y'all good, y'all good with the last cops. They say, y'all good with us, man. Y'all good with us. And, and they, they got left. edified. They got edified. And they left. The cop for that probably they told they used to just move on this side of the road. All right, let's move on this side of the road. Hey, he out That's of there. It. We cause the show the show continues, man. But check this out. It says, For rulers are not a terror to good works, but to the evil. Hmm. Wilt thou then not be afraid of the power? Hmm. Do not fuck it. Do that which is good, and thou shalt have praise of the same. <laughs> for he is the minister of the most high. To thee for good. So the most, so 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 the Lord said that this man is a minister of the Most High for the, for for thee unto good. Yeah. I mean, if you're going off, this man is going is, is going to put your ass your ass in check. Yeah, and it's really the Most High that's putting your ass in that's check. Right, that's so right. really, what happened was the, the Most High put that brother in check. Hey, the Most High and Most High put a spirit on those men to go 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 over there and 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 do them how they did him. Yep, that's a form of judgment, man. Mm -hmm. Now, real quick concerning that, this is what one of his uh, followers said on my on a comment board. It says. He said, yeah, we still in captivity, but time is definitely changing. Yeah, yeah, Ain't no it. more, okay, master, I'm going to be quiet, spirit, especially with the men of the Lord. I said, what does Matthew 5 and 25 mean? No response. Yeah, he's a whole shit. Silence. I never read that before. Never read that. And this guy, you know, these guys, man, they... They, they, they have thinking, no works. Exactly. They, have they don't no want works. to have no works. They, they, they ain't doing shit. Nothing. They just, just run their mouth. Running their mouth. That they, they bringing that, that nigga spirit into the truth, into man. Israel, yeah. That's yeah. it. It's, hey, all a lot of these guys, man, they nothing but niggas with fringes on, man. Yeah, yeah. They put fringes on and they think they can rebuke everybody and anybody, but when rebuke comes to them, they can't take it. And they can't why, handle it. That's why you got these motherfuckers talking about Black Lives Matter and shit, man, because niggas getting gunned down. All right, because they the Lord is ordaining niggas to get gunned down. Because if if you are uh, unruly, just brute beast as of, of, of a nigga, especially if you got fringes on, the Lord is gonna get away with you, man, because you are you are putting on a bad example, example for, for for the nation, man. Let me finish this up real quick. It says, um, but if thou do that which is evil, be afraid, for he beareth not the sword in vain. Mm. So this man, he like I said, he got he ain't got that gun on his hip for no reason, man. The, 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 the Lord put a spirit, put, put, gave these people the power to be able to walk around here with guns on their hip. Okay, and if, and if you get a preview, if, if you even so much as hit one, they can have fucking 20 more on, on, on you and your ass. That this is all during thing by the most high, man. Yep. Okay, and he says he don't bear that sword in vain. So this man has, has the power to destroy you, man. And if he kills you, it's rightfully so. Yeah. At the end of the day. Yep. And at the end of the day, when when George Floyd died, that was uh, a judgment from Yahweh Shimei Hashem. That's right. That's right. That's right. So if you would have died, that would have been what? Judgment, judgment from Yahweh Shimei Hashem. That was shot, man. And the whole point is to not die. And then they would try, they would try to make him a martyr for fucking nigger tree, man. Yeah. Right. Right. <laughs> it shows you, man. This is why the Lord. This is why the Lord had great ears at 33 years old, man. A head full of gray hairs, because Jake is, is stressful, man. Our people are stressful. All right, it says, um, he 
beareth not the sword in vain, for he is the minister of the, uh, of the Most High, a revenger to execute wrath upon him that doeth evil. And evil is anything that is against the will and the commandments of our Lord, man. Yep. So if you're going against the ways and the commandments of our Lord, then that, that's doing evil. The Lord won't judge you for doing that, man. Yep. All right, and it might be, you know what I'm saying, you're getting hemmed up against the wall on the concrete, getting cursed up by a police officer just to get thrown in the back of a, of a damn car to be cast into prison, man. Yeah, I got a, I got a beautiful precept. Titus 3 and 1. Hey, I mean, let me ask you quick. You don't, get, you don't get cool points for going to jail. Yeah, okay, no. and it's true. That, that don't make you cool, man. What make you cool is that, if it, it, shit, make you cool if you can get out of jail, man. Okay, avoid going to jail and still bring out this word. Yep. Okay, people see that shit all the time where they see us out of teaching and the police come up and they come up with their badges and shit walking like with that police walk and shit and everybody was like oh shit police come look, look. and then you know so when the police come in, everybody stopping they watching they want to watch and shit mm -hmm. then they see the pool down if you deal with the police according to the scriptures and the police walk away and then you continue to bring the show on so they couldn't stop the show yeah then then, then that, that 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 right there is something more 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 to marvel at than a nigga getting cast into a, to a damn get, getting manhandled into a police car <laughs> what was that? titus three and one put them in mind to be subject to principalities and powers to obey uh, magistrates, to be ready to every good work, mm -hmm. to speak evil of no man, to be no brawlers, no brawlers, so but gentle. Gentle. Okay. So the Lord is telling you to come in the spirit you should be in, not in the spirit of brawlers, not in these guys. Oh y'all, y'all really telling me y'all going? Oh y'all clowns, y'all clowns. And nigga, you, you go out there and fight the police then. You, you, I want to see you niggas go out there and, and, and wrestle with the police. You don't want to fuck with the police. The police going to beat your ass, man. You going to end up like an old boy, man. Or, or they're or they, or they, or they going to kill, kill, kill you, man. Yep. That's going to be the last week we ever heard of you. It's as simple as that. Yeah, you're going to be forgotten. So when it comes to dealing with certain things, a lot of you guys ain't, ain't, ain't good to go to for advice, man. Yep. <laughs> but it said, put them in mind to be subject to principalities and powers. Who are the powers that be right now? These fucking devils, man. Mm -hmm. All right, now you 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 uh, uh, apply that, but with wisdom, man. These devils come up and they got a badge and they telling you gonna go to jail if you don't step over here. What do you do? You step over there. You, you talk to them, man on man, man. Mm -hmm. And then you can push the word down the road. Find another spot. Push the word, word man. But it says uh, to be no brawlers, but gentle, showing all meekness unto all men. All right, mm -hmm. you gotta be meek. All right, and them guys were, were not meek. They were not harmless as doves. You know, you had the guy barking at the sergeant. Sergeant! Sergeant! <laughs> sergeant over there arresting your buddy. You sergeant! Come on, man. Proverbs 16 and 32. He that is slow to anger is better than the mighty. And he that ruleth his spirit than he that taketh a city, man. Mm -hmm. So you got to rule your spirit, man. You got to have the power and might in your mind. Hey, this truth is a mind game, man. Um, it's not about outward appearance. You can have the nicest garments, coolest. You have the most followers. If you don't apply these, these scriptures, man, you, you're not going to endure into the end. The yeah, whole point yeah. of coming into the truth is to endure into the end, man. Not to get caught up in Jacob's trouble and go to jail. Jacob. Now, the scriptures, the scriptures say that whoever lives godly is going to suffer persecution, man. God, we're God. ready for persecution when it comes, but there's a way to avoid it in the times that we're in right now. Mm -hmm. Hey, when, when, when the devil comes in like a flood, they coming in like a flood. Yeah, that, yeah. That's that. Mm -hmm. But if you out at camp and they telling you, hey, come over here, just just move, man. Yep. Hey, and 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 and, and all the occult personalities and all these fucking characters y'all be playing and shit. These guys gotta wear their fucking head wraps a certain way and do this and do that and, and third and stuff. That right there is all vanity, man, and and and, and it's all for naught, man. All right. It's, it's not according to the script, the spirit of your whole body, y'all shot. You you really just put on the show for men, and the Most High sees that, man. All right, the Lord said that he tried the reins of every man's heart, so he know your mind. He, he know what's going on up here. You, you thinking he don't see, he see it, man. Oh, okay? Boy. I'm bring this out real quick. Um, this is the book of Sirach, chapter 9, verse 13. Keep thee far from the man that have the power to kill. Yep. Yep. So this man has the power to kill, man. And, and you, you, and, you and the right, right spirit, you should want to stay far from this man. You ain't trying to out there cause a commotion so he come around man you ain't questioning the devil don't, qu <laughs> don't question the fucking devil even man. in the world man i i ain't never deal with the police man i don't do with the police now so right. they come about it hey, i can help you sir yeah yeah oh yeah we did that for you yeah right, right sir yeah, gotcha. yeah, yeah. and i'm still alive I, 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 i'm not in a lot of these guys they ain't never been in no fucking trouble man if you've been in trouble before man you ain't trying to get back in trouble trying to go back there, you, right? ain't, you ain't trying to go deal, deal with that shit again man but these guys it's, it's like they, they ain't never seen it before they they, they, they they gotta see it to believe it they, they gotta beat up to to, to, to to feel like they know it's reality is not fun it's not cool man 
All right, if you can avoid going to jail, that makes you a better prophet, man. Yeah. All right, because what? You are using the spirit and the scriptures to avoid trouble coming unto you, man. Yeah. All right, to, to make to, to, to make your walk easier. All right, rather than making it harder because you want to be a damn brute beast with no spirituality, man. Yeah, especially in a situation like that, man. That could have easily been avoided, man. And that's that's really why brothers have doing, been doing lessons and why we're doing this lesson is because we know it could have been avoided. Um, now, if we saw that, let's say the brother agreed, he did everything correctly, and he still went to jail. Hey, man, that hey, you yeah. you you held it you held it right. You did what's right, and you still went to jail. That would be some, that would be like what what happened to the prophets of the old time. Yeah, and then this video would, 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 would be going in a different direction. And exactly, we would be honestly giving praise. Like, hey, the brother did what's right, and hey, this is a hey, persecution is coming. Mm -hmm. But we see it like, yo, that could have been avoided. A bunch of niggas, yeah. A bu that could have been completely avoided, man. All right. Let me finish this up. It says, uh, keep thee far, keep thee far from the man that hath the power to kill. So, so shalt thou not doubt the fear of death. And if thou come unto him, make no fault, lest he take away thy life presently. Today is make no fault. So don't be questioning this guy when he coming up telling you to move, man. Telling you simple, a simple order. He he warns you and lets you know if you don't move, you're gonna go to jail. But hey. you a who? When? Where? Huh? Hey, grab X five and whatever, 28. Mm -hmm. Come hey. on, man. It says, remember that thou goest in the midst of snares mm. and that thou walkest upon the battlements of the city. Yep. So that means, hey, you gotta remember that you, first of all, you, you, you are in Babylon, the valley of the shadow of your land, you're in captivity. You gotta, when it says remember, it means really remember this. Take into mind that nigga, you are in captivity. You are a slave here. Well, you, you come into the tree, find all this, all, all this knowledge. Well, don't forget the knowledge about how we in the land of our captivity, how, how these devils are our enemy. How they, they, they're the ones that put us in slavery and trying to destroy us to this day. They want to exterminate us, man. Mm. You can't forget these things, man. You got to remember that um, they have set up snares for us, man. You you you, you used to see Jake's getting locked, get, getting fucking shackled up in prison in droves. You, you, why? Because they, they have put snares before us, man. They wait for a nigga to, to, to jump out of line so they can lock your ass up and throw away the key. They can't wait to. Okay, what you're doing is no different than any other unruly ass nigga in, in the streets, man. Con. The Lord is not dealing with that, man. Hey, hey, the Lord is holding us up to a pedestal, man. Yep. He's saying, these, 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 these are my prophets. These are my men. These are my men doing my work. And you got to act like any other nigga fucking shooting a music video out there. Hey, man, it ain't right, man. Hey, I guarantee if you would have applied these scriptures, if the brother would have applied these scriptures, he wouldn't have went downtown, man. Yep. He wouldn't have went to jail, man. If you would have applied these scriptures, you wouldn't have went to jail, man. Because the Lord would have saw that you were applying it in the spirit and he would have fought for you. Hey. At that point, when you start bucking up against the scripture, the Lord, hey, the Lord takes a step back. Yeah, All good. right, go hey. ahead. And, and it's like when, when you think about it on a, on, 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 on a, a minute level, man, you ain't got to get deep for this, man. Right. But Jake and the world, when, when they out there in the streets and shit, they do stupid shit to go to jail so that they can get more street cred. Yeah, so street they, cred so, right. so that they, 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 they can be, be looked at as, oh, oh, this guy been been to prison and back, oh, you know, don't fuck him, don't fuck him, he been to prison, he been to jail, he been, he been up the road, don't fuck him, don't fuck him. You know what I'm saying? So they get some type of uh, a title behind their name. And this truth, it, 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 you can't be doing that shit in this truth, man. All right, and that's going to show that these guys haven't been renewed because they're doing the same shit the motherfucker will be doing in the world trying to bring it to, to, to this truth. Yeah. And this truth, that shit going to get you a whole lot of pain and trouble, man. Okay, a whole lot more, more problems than, 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 than damn solutions. I, I guarantee you that. Yep. All right. I got a precept. Mm -hmm. Proverbs 2 and 10. When wisdom entereth into thine heart and knowledge is pleasant unto thy soul, discretion shall preserve thee. Mm, discretion shall preserve thee. So, hey, if you come in, when wisdom is within into your heart and into your soul, hey, that discretion of, of, of just, you know what I'm saying? You, well, you know what discretion is? Discretion is knowing when, to, when, when and when and when not to do something. Okay, there's a time and a place for everything. That's discretion. All right, so bring that back. It says, discretion shall preserve thee. Mm -hmm. Discretion, by knowing that prescription, that, that's going to keep you alive, man. Mm -hmm. keep, 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 keep you out of trouble. Keep you out of, out of jail. And it said, when wisdom, wisdom entereth into thy heart, man. Mm -hmm. So when you really apply wisdom, ultimately you're going to have the discretion to know when and when not to do certain things, man. Mm -hmm. It says, understanding shall keep thee to deliver thee from the way of the evil man from the man that speaketh forward things. Mm -hmm. All right, so hey, you apply wisdom, man. You apply wisdom. Uh, real quick, Luke 9 and 5. And whosoever will not receive you when ye go out of that city, shake off the dust from your feet 
for a testimony against them. So you ain't never got to fight for no spot, man. Right. If they telling you that you got to go or they want you to leave, hey, man, just get up out of there, man. Go to another mm -hmm. spot and you might be, be bring out more edification on that spot than the first spot. All right? Con, you got any more precepts? Yeah, that's it on that, man. All right. Um, Mosquitoes out here. Real. James 1 and 22, be ye doers of the word and not hearers only, mm -hmm. deceiving your own selves, so man. So when you come into this thing, man, you're supposed to be doing or you got to be doing, man. You got to be, you know what I'm saying? So when you get the scriptures, you know what I'm saying? You can't just hear them as you, as you read them. You got to be actually, you know what I'm saying, put, put, putting these to your life, man. All right, when the, when you, when the scripture read them brought out, these, these, those guys ain't, bringing, ain't, 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 ain't quote none of those scriptures, man. Yep. So obviously they, they, they ain't doing those scriptures, man. They, they, they heard them and they, 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 they just, they like they ain't hear them. Yep. But now you got to hear them and do them, man, all of them. Even the ones that, that, that they brought out. Yeah, apply eight like the scripture in Sirach, 20, well, what, 25, I believe. Uh, there's one that teaches many and yet is unprofitable to himself, man. Do not be unprofitable to yourself, Israel. Apply these scriptures, and that's every day. Every day when people are watching, when you alone, apply the scriptures, man. You might have certain temptations. Apply the word, man. Apply the word, apply the word, apply the word. That's the test because the hour of temptation is coming. And when the hour of temptation comes, Jacob's trouble comes, we must apply the word. That's right. If you don't, you're going to die, end up in prison, get beheaded, whatever. You know? And, that, and that's that. You ain't going to make it, man. You ain't going to make it. The whole point is to make it, man. All right? So, hey, Lord willing, it was edifying to the hopeful elect. All right? We're going to close out by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh, Shai, Ba'ashim, 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 Ba'